So I get a lot of comments about how to update the drivers and make sure they're, you know, ready to go and they're game ready for all of your new games. So I just wanted to make a video, a uh, quick one, and show you guys how to stay up to date on your drivers. Uh, you'll want to go to desktop side for this for best, uh, you know, the best way to update them and make sure they're, you know, good to go. <coughs> So what you'll do is you'll go down here, it should be already open, or if you can, uh, open up NVIDIA GeForce Experience, and you'll come to this screen. Um, here's my rig, just to show you guys, I have the i3 Alpha, when I upgraded it to 8 gigs of RAM, and I'm on the latest drivers. So what you'll do is you'll go up here to drivers, you'll hit check for update, it'll run through everything do its job I'm already up to date so it won't really show anything but it'll come up if you aren't up to date it'll ask you to do an express installation or a custom one I just go ahead and do express I don't really want to mess around with anything and you'll see that I'm on the latest drivers for just cause 3 and rainbow 6 siege Note that these uh, drivers don't really help Just Cause 3 at the moment from what I have seen and experienced. And like I told everybody else on those videos, I hopefully will get some type of patch or patches in the coming weeks to ensure a better performing game. Another thing I want to show you is games. If you go over here, um, certain games that are eligible for it and compatible you can optimize it for your system any way you want it to like if I go to settings and if I want to do you know better performance or quality you can do it or you can do optimal and you can apply those settings and then you just go down to each game and hit optimize as long as you have ran the game at least once before and opened it it'll be on this list so you just go through everything you hit optimize it'll change the settings for you boom using optimized settings so whenever you launch the game it'll automatically apply those settings so you don't have to and you don't have to worry about messing around with anything and just you'll get a you know a better performing game based on what Nvidia has decided so yeah, that was just a quick video showing you guys how to do this. Uh, if you think it was helpful, hit like, maybe subscribe. I'll be testing a bunch of games coming up. And uh, just let me know what you want to see. And I'll do my best to accommodate all of your requests. Thank you.